In a world where two completely different animals collide together to form a mermaid, one artist will merge two art mediums completely different into one art medium. Okay. Today's video, as I'm sure you could tell from the title, is all about one of my favorite art mediums ever, watercolor pencils. Now. I think watercolor pencils are amazing. Um, I love coloring with colored pencils, and I also love painting with watercolor paints. But did you know that you could have the best of both worlds with a thing called watercolor pencils? Yes! Yeah, I know. Shocking. So in, in this video, I thought it would be fun to do a mermaid, because mermaids combine two completely different things. A beautiful woman and a, a beautiful fish tail um, and which you know directly relates to uh, watercolor pencils which are combining two completely different mediums uh, colored pencils and watercolor paint and the exact colored pencils that I'll be using today are the Stade Tiller don't know how to pronounce that and it's spelled backwards because of the way I'm doing my camera. I'm sorry about that, but the Stadler colored wa watercolor pencils, 12 pack, triangular barrel. And I gotta say, I love these. Um, I'll I'll try to put links down below in the description for you if you want to like buy the exact same uh, products that I'm using. And just to prevent any kind of I don't know, property rights or copywriting infringement. Uh, this is the coloring book that I'm using. I know it's backwards again, guys, I'm sorry, but it's Tattoo Coloring Book for Adults. Anyways, I'll maybe I'll, I'll see if I can find a link to that too, in case you wanna do this exact thing yourself. Um, so yeah, I thought, I thought it would be fun to uh, do a colorful like highlights in her hair. I was very close to doing her entire hair rainbow colors, um, you know, since it's uh, Pride Month and everything, and everybody seems to be uh, doing rainbows and whatnot. Um, and I was really close, like this close to doing it, but I thought it would be too much, and so I just made her blonde with like a few really cool, colorful, like mini rainbow highlights. And this is the finished product of just the color penciling and uh, it looks pretty decent just I could have left it like that been happy stuck it on my refrigerator um, and uh, been good to go oh I wanted to use every color in the kit so I'm, I'm adding some bubbles here uh, with the light blue but on to the fun part adding water so as you can see all you do to make the magic happen is get a paintbrush dip it in some water and then uh, you just start painting on top of what you've already colored. And just like that, um, you're now painting with watercolor paint, sort of. And it is really, really cool. I absolutely love this. This is one of my favorite mediums of all time. Um, it is just so fun. Uh, you, can, you can blend two, two different colors together um, by just doing them on top of each other as the pencils and then coming in later with the water on top and it kind of mashes them all together uh, you can get nice nice beautiful blends sort of like how I'm doing with this tail with the two different tones of green and um, man this is so much fun I, I just love this it's way it's not messy at all either like this would be perfect for kids um, because there's no actual paint uh, it's it's just water let me move my head out of the way it's just water. it's just water on the paintbrush and so um, there's no no real spillage I mean unless you uh, unless like they spill their cup of water that would be like the only thing really um, so all you moms and dads out there who uh, have kids interested in painting but you know you no way in heck that you're gonna give them paint like real paint to ruin your stuff with this is the perfect solution for you I highly recommend this it, it is so much fun 
and it can lead it can lead to bigger and better things too like if uh your child develops talent for this kind of thing you know the more the older they get the more responsible they get you know you can slowly start giving them more responsibilities with uh, m more more messier art products so yeah I'm just going along splashing water and all these things um, making them really pop and uh, having so much fun in the process I, I mean it it's probably fun to watch but it's even more fun to do. Um, if you haven't tried this before, go get you a set, click on my links if they're still up, um, and have fun, because it, it really is fun. Something about it. And uh, let me know what you think about her hair. Should I have made her a redhead, like the Little Mermaid? I was really close. I almost made her Ariel from the Little Mermaid since I know that movie just came out um, and I was I was gonna do it I was also I was like I I can I can make her Ariel the Little Mermaid and um, that would have been you know like appropriate for because re the recent movie came out but I'm like you know what let's do let's do the rainbow hair thing and then I decided we'll just make her have those colorful blonde you know the highlights and stuff I also gave her a little bit of makeup. Um, I, what is it called? Eye? Is it eyeshadow? I can't. I actually don't know. I'm not a makeup person, but um, I like how it turned out. I didn't go too 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 crazy with it. I did go a little crazy on her lipstick. I will admit, but I like it. I mean, she she is a beautiful mermaid, so you know. Let's uh let's highlight that. Now in the, the anchor behind her, um, I used two different colors. I did a base shade of black and then dark blue to give it that steel look. And um, I think it works great. So yeah, this is the close up of my, the finished piece. Just kind of showing off a little bit and giving you an idea of how vibrant the colors are. The colors are very nice. I have to say, like this art kit or um, this pencil set does not seem cheap at all. Like it seems like a quality set. I I would definitely recommend buying this if you do want to try it out. Um, tons of fun. You're gonna need a paintbrush too. Uh, any paintbrush will do. Doesn't have to be fancy. Well, that's it for this one, guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, give me a big like the video and uh, let me know in the comments what you thought if you like the mermaid's hair and if you didn't like the video let me know in the comments what I could have done better love you guys and I'll talk to you later bye bye